All right, you are looking at a sheep brain, and this is a follow-up to a video I made earlier on removing the dura mater. And so here's this, the tough mother, the dura mater. What I want to do is actually look at some different sections of the brain. And so, for example, most of you might be familiar with this as a mid-sagittal cut. When you see a mid-sagittal cut, now you can see this is the medial view. Of course, that would be the lateral view. Here is a undissected brain with the dura mater intact. All right. So this is a follow-up to a previous video. So uh, go ahead and go to the PowerPoint. All right. So we're going to try and cover some of the... the we're not going to identify every part of the brain here. Um, I've, uh, I have other videos for that, but we want to look at different looks. So one more slide brought to you by... brought to you by Curious Moranland. So next. So we're quite familiar with uh, identifying the lobes of the brain, and you'll see the fissures, the sulcus. We can kind of see that in this picture. And we're going to use the PowerPoint here, a live camera shot of brains, and also another website. So go ahead and go one more. And you should be able to see a lot of this. All right, and let's go ahead and go one more and see what we get. All right, so this cross-section is your mid-sagittal. And so let's go back to the camera for a second. All right. You can see your standard. Here's your corpus callosum, your cerebellum, you know, their brain stem. The, you can obviously see the cerebral cortex. Um, when you look here, you can see the optic chiasma. You can see a little bit of it here got cut off, and you might be to see the olfactory lobe bulb, which is part of olfactory nerve, cranial nerve one. Now, this is pretty cool. We're going to go ahead and uh, go to some software really quickly. All right, and this is on a human, now, which is opposed to the sheep brain, but you're going to see some a couple things. So let's click this uh, corpus callosum. Click the little tab there. There's your corpus callosum. You'll see, if we move down here, we'll see the mammary body. All right. Oh, actually, that's, some, that's the third, yeah. third ventricle. All right, uh, third ventricle, and the, the lateral ventricles are in the corpus callosum. All right, and let's kind of see what we've got here. All right, so your midbrain, we see right here, we have the pons, and over here we see the cerebellum. Okay, and then of course you see the main brain stem working down here. This would be your medulla, and of course now we're at the spinal cord. Over here, you see the pituitary gland, which is embedded in this bone, just kind of around here. That's the silica tersica, if you remember from your, your skull anatomy. And of course, this big structure out here, if you click anywhere in there, maybe right here, you'll see just this cerebellum. All right, so we're going to, that's a, a lot of people are familiar with brain dissections that, where it's just the mid sagittal slice. Let's go back to the camera for a second. All right, so we're familiar with this. What we want to do is talk about a couple other slices, okay? And so we're going to go ahead and just pause for a second and change our view. All right, so here's another sagittal. Now that was your mid-sagittal you saw up here, but what, one of the things the students did today is they did their sagittal, like you've seen before, and then they did another little slice here. We actually have this, so look at this. This is kind of, well, this is the really first time I've actually had students do that. And one of the things that's unique is you can you can see the, the white matter, the gray matter, you can see, actually this is a really, it's not, this is part of the corpus callosum. I can see that ventricle there. Let's lace that back in here. So we're slicing like that. Now, that is still mid-sagittal, mid and then that would technically be sagittal if we're off the midline. So let's look at another type of view. So go back to the PowerPoint. Down, down one more. All right. Now, that's, yeah, go to that, go to that one. Okay. Let's go to the camera and see well, how did we get this. Okay. Now I'm going to try and show you the brain. Now look at this. So this is a no longer a sagittal. This is a coronal. All right. Take a look at that. Now they unfortunately <laughs> they cut this part off. So the brainstem and the cerebellum, which should be like this. Okay. So that part they cut off. But we got a really good. Oh, well, let's get our frame of reference here. All right. Here we are. So here is. This would be the anterior. That's the posterior where it's trying to attach this back. That's 
where this is. Okay, you can see the corporate quadrigemina right there, right? And so this is a coronal, partial coronal, and then the brain stem and the cerebellum they did a sag. This is a sagittal cut. Sag that's a sagittal cut. So we got kind of two both going on there. All right. So I know there's the here's the inferior view now. But let's do a superior view, and then separate it. Now here we are. Okay. Let's go ahead and go to the software. All right, now, first thing he's going to do is he's going to click layer two. Now, look up at the top, bring the mouse around here. This is a guide as to where you're going. This little blue line is showing what we just cut. Now, he's going to click layer three. Okay. And so this is pretty much the view that we saw. You can see the gray matter. You can see the, oh, I'm sorry, the gray matter here. You can see the white matter. Now, let's, what is this structure? That is your corpus callosum. It's connecting, kind of like that, connecting this hemisphere and this hemisphere. Now, this is kind of strange. You're going to have to come all the way down here. Let's click this. That is your third ventricle. Now, let's click over here. There is your hypothalamus. So, the, what you can't really see, you see the hypothalamus. The thalamus is actually, uh, would be on top of this. So, just kind of wave them out front. But would be on top of this. And, and, and kind of penetrate, the third ventricle kind of penetrates through there. All right, so that's, that's what a coronal view is going to do for you. All right, so let's go back to the camera. All right, I, well, there's one more view, and I think we're going to pause and uh, go to the PowerPoint first. All right. Just hit PowerPoint mode. We just looked at this view. Now you're going to go down one. And we've seen this before, down one more. We did this today. So let's go to uh, the camera and pause and reset some things. All right, let's take one more view. Okay, we've seen coronal, we've seen mid sagittal. Very rarely do we get to do this. Transverse, which means we can take this little top off there. All right. That's cool. All right. Now, again, you can see white matter. You can see gray matter. You can see the, the cerebellum here. And you need to flip over here. There's the olfactory bulbs. Okay. And this little wing here, we can actually see the corpus callosum right here. And let's go ahead and go to the software. And now take a look at the software. If you click layer two, you don't see it yet. Layer three, you don't see it. Layer four, you're going to do one more cut. Boom. All right, let's see right here. We got, there's your corpus callosum. All right. And then we we'll see these right here. Those are the lateral ventricles, which you usually only see when you do the, um, the mid sagittal cut. When you do that, you kind of can stick the probe in there and actually see that open space. So that's pretty much it. Uh, I don't know what this is. Let's just see. All right now, that's a very interesting view. From here, you should be able to see the thalamus. So let's go back and see if we can identify it on the camera. Okay, I think they actually had this. Yeah, that's part of the problem. Okay. So this is the ventricles. I know that because I can actually stick here. Now, what I'm going to do, so I'm going to grab, let's get our, I'm sticking right here, which is this. This is the ventricle inside here. So if you notice when I hit the brain, do the move it around here, that's the same thing that would be happening if I had this different view. So this is actually the corpus callosum with the lateral ventricles in there. And then this is, so let's kind of think about it like this. There's your thalamus. This is the mammary, what we call the mammary body. This is the third ventricle. This is the lateral ventricle. You, you can't see the third here. You'd have to have a what we call a medial view. All right, so that's pretty much our little walk through different sections of the brain. And obviously, we didn't identify all the anatomy, but I have other videos for that. So uh, let's go back to the PowerPoint. This down arrow. Brought to you by Curious Brandland. And thanks for watching. So just go back to the camera and...
All right.